Here are the nominees for Outstanding Lead Performance in a TV Movie or Limited Series. Tay Diggs, The Best Man, The Final Chapters. Giancarlo Esposito, Kaleidoscope. Regina Hall, The Best Man, The Final Chapters. Brian Tyree Henry, Class of 09. Terrence Howard, The Best Man, The Final Chapter. Dominique Fishback, Swarm. Sanal Lay then, The Best Man, The Final Chapters. Nia Long, The Best Man, The Final Chapters. Harold Perrineau, The Best Man, The Final Chapters. Zoe Saldana, From Scratch. And the bolt goes to Dominique Fishback Swarm. This is the first bolt award for Dominique Fishback. Here are the nominees for Outstanding Screenplay. A Thousand and One, Screenplay by A.V. Rockwell. American Fiction, Screenplay by Cord Jefferson. Origin, Screenplay by Ava DuVernay. Rustin. Screenplay by Julian Brees and Dustin Lance Black. They cloned Tyrone. Screenplay by Tony Rettenmayer and Jewel Taylor. And the bolt goes to Cord Jefferson for American Fiction. This is the third bolt for Cord Jefferson. He won earlier for Outstanding Emerging Director and First Screenplay for American Fiction. Hey everyone, thank you so much for this tremendous, tremendous honor. Writing was my first creative love. It will always be my my first creative love. Uh, I really, really appreciate your support in this endeavor. Uh, I'd like to thank specifically uh, Percival Everett, who wrote the novel Erasure that I adapted for this film. Uh, Percival is a is a, a real living genius. If you haven't had the opportunity to read Erasure. I, uh, I suggest that you do. It is a real work of art, and uh, I would not be here without him. He's, uh, he's one of our greatest living novelists, and um, his support has meant the world to me. So thank you to him. Thank you to the Black Reel Awards. This is, this is very meaningful to me. Thank you. Here are the nominees for Outstanding Independent Film. A Thousand and One. You used to like when I got spicy. Try and be quiet. You should try and be quiet, right? Quiet like when you were missing for weeks and I sat here and said nothing. And never mind who you was with. Today. If I get any more quieter, I won't even have a f***ing voice at all. All Dirt Roads Taste of Salt. You want to know a secret? It doesn't end or begin. It just changes form. <laughs> Earth Mama. You gotta start speaking up in class. Have you ever helped anybody with an open adoption? How I Learned to Fly. Ever since Dad left us, I keep having these dreams. Where are your parents? Mom is on a holiday. You don't talk much, huh? Last night, though, 
something strange happened. Ray Lane. Perfectly. Babe, that outfit? Tens across the board. <sighs> Thank you so much. You know that. Man, she looks fire, isn't it? What's up, man? Cool kicks. What? Dick head. And the bolt goes to A.V. Rockwell for a thousand and one. This is the first bolt for A.V. Rockwell. Thank you so much to Black Real TV for this incredible honor. It's fun to win stuff, yay. Um, first and foremost, I'd like to thank Toko Nagata and Lamont Kwame, who were my partners in the grind. Uh, huge, huge thank you to Malcolm Lee, who without these characters that it created, we wouldn't even be a part of such an incredible project. Thank you for believing us and working with us like thought partners. Um, I'd also like to thank my blackmail family, shout out Dominique Telson, and of course, NBC Peacock for believing in us, and um, thank you. Here are the nominees for Outstanding Supporting Performance. Erica Alexander, American Fiction. Danielle Brooks, The Color Purple. Sterling K. Brown, American Fiction. Coleman Domingo, The Color Purple. Viola Davis, Air. Jamie Foxx, They Cloned Tyrone. Tarad G. P. Henson, The Color Purple. Jonathan Majors, Creed 3. Divine Joy Randolph, The Holdovers. Journey Smollett, The Burial. And the bolt goes to Danielle Brooks, The Color Purple. This is the first bolt for Danielle Brooks. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Black Real Awards for acknowledging my work in The Color Purple as Sophia. I am over the moon. I am just living in every moment of all of this. And I'm so glad that I um, am sharing this with you all in this way and receiving these flowers from you. I uh, am so grateful that I got to step into the role of Sophia, someone who is so beloved by our community. And you all have enjoyed my work. Um, and thank you obviously to the incredible cast and crew because I wouldn't be nothing um, without the people that I work with that brought out the best in my performance. So I'm very humbled and I thank you for this. Here are the nominees for Outstanding Lead Performance in a Comedy Series. Ta Sheena Arnold, The Neighborhood. Quinta Brunson, Abbott Elementary. Cedric the Entertainer, The Neighborhood. Donald Glover, Atlanta. Megan Good, Harlem. Jasmine Sipas Jones, Lynn Spotting. Delroy Lindo, Unprisoned. Robin Thede, A Black Lady Sketch Show. Carrie Washington, Unprisoned. Patricia Ms. Pat Williams, The Ms. Pat Show. And the bolt goes to Quinta Brunson Abbott Elementary. That is the fifth bolt award for Quinta Brunson. Here are the nominees for outstanding lead performance in a drama series. Jacob Anderson, Anne Rice's interview with the vampire. Nico A. Nun, P Valley. Jabbar Ree Banks, Bel Air. Angela Bassett, 911. 
Damn Sun Edris, Snowfall, Queen Latifah, The Equalizer, Patina Miller, Power Book 3, Raising Cannon, Harold Perrineau from Octavia Spencer, Truth Be Told, Forrest Whitaker, Godfather of Harlem, and The Bolt Goes to Damn Sun Edris Snowfall, that is the first Bolt Award for Damn Sun Idris. Here are the nominees for Outstanding Comedy Series. Abbott Elementary. The ticket's the answer is obvious. The most tenured teacher. So you mean you. With all due respect, I think the ticket should go to the MVP, you know, the young star who gives everyone faith in the franchise again. Or the tickets could go to the most improved player, someone who sacrificed other goals to focus on this one, someone young, someone driven, someone... Handsome. You know what? Yeah. Atlanta. Oh. Hey. What are you doing? Uh, I got this air fryer as a gift, but then I remember to have an oven. Are, are you returning this? Look, I don't have the receipt. I know what you're thinking, but I was thinking maybe we could make a trade, you know, maybe something like that. Harlem. Did I quit my job last night? What? Wait, Quinn, you told me to quit my job last night. How much did y'all have to drink? Why are you giving up a real advice? I can fix this. All you need is a taxi backseat. A taxi backseat, you know, like when you're a kid and you say a bad word and you get a taxi backseat. Three taxi backseats a month. <laughs> Unprisoned. Hey, this pot roast is tasty. Oh, thank you. Mm. It's my mom's recipe. <laughs> Finn, can you pass the salt? Sure. Are you serious right now? The Upshaws. Dear God, why you keep letting me do this shit to myself? Quit crying like a prison bitch. Your stupid fault we're in here. All I did was buy some cheap parts. How the hell was I supposed to know they was hot? By thinking, dummy. And the bolt goes to Abbott Elementary. This is Abbott Elementary's second win in this category and the sixth Bolt Award for showrunner Quinda Brunson. Here are the nominees for Outstanding Drama Series. Bel Air. Yeah, I, I feel really, really good about that. That video was boring as fuck. Drew. Yo, Tyler, get a picture of this. We promised no signs, Will. Yeah, I got you. I'll post this. My guy, big ally things. <laughs> sure. Uh, excuse me. Are you serious? Look, you should be getting that on camera. Godfather of Harlem. What's up? Why are you bringing the crew to the sit down? Because I don't trust none of you fucks. Chin Giganti put a hit out on me. Something he couldn't have done without your fucking approval. The fuck are you talking about? I bring in all the dope. Make millions for you greedy bastards. Got rid of Bumpy fucking Johnson. This is how you repay me. Get the fucking sanction taken off my head. Hey, tough guy. P Valley. Hey, I bet you're raw dogging with a lane. Huh. Fuck what you heard, what you know. Hey, I've never been scared of a hoe. Hey, I'm looking for you, bitch, lay low. Oh, hoes wanna go toe to toe. Bitch, how pretty, please. How want you to come say something to me? I've really been itching to go to fuck off. How put this just if he healing your mouth? Queen Charlotte, a Bridgerton story. Untie him! Untie the king! (laughs) 
snowfall. It's a long story. <laughs> She's doing great, though. Trying to get into the music business. You fucking with me right now. And the bolt goes to Snowfall. This is Snowfall's first win in this category and the first bolt for showrunner Dave Andron. Take the chopper. Oh, here's that chopper. Death blade, sidewinder. It's go time. Roger that wet blanket. No, from now on, call me Velvet. Thank you so much to everybody that voted for me for this honor. Uh, but I gotta say this, I could not have done it by myself. This is all because of Malcolm Lee. He created an incredible legacy. And for the final chapters, I was just blessed and honored to direct a few episodes. I wanna thank everybody, the cast, the crew, as well as the, the fantastic team at Peacock. Bless you all. Oh my goodness, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Black Real Awards. I'm so, this means so much to me because Directing this episode, this pilot episode of Reasonable Doubt, it was one of the most fun and exciting and truly challenging things that I've ever gotten to do as an artist. But it was such a joy because the words that Ramla Muhammad wrote were so inspiring. Her vision is incredible. And the performances by the whole cast, especially Emma Yatsi, everyone just made this the greatest joy. Um, I love this show. I'm so deeply grateful to the entire cast, the entire crew that helped make it happen, um, to everybody at Onyx. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And to you, Black Real Awards, thank you and God bless and yay!
Hello, and thank you, Black Reel Awards, for the Outstanding Editing Award for Spider-Verse. Uh, it's an honor to be recognized along with such incredibly talented fellow nominees. Uh, Spider-Verse was an amazing collaboration of a thousand people who brought this film to life. Uh, I want to thank the producers, the directors, and a special thanks to my incredible editorial crew, Andy Leviton, Chet Hoffman, Erica Scapelli, Nina Latti, and Freddie Ferrari, who worked tirelessly and carried me on their backs all the way to the finish line. Uh, people don't always recognize what editorial does, especially on an animated movie, so it's an absolute joy when we get some recognition for the work we do. Um, you know, I love Miles Morales, he's one of the best characters in modern cinema, and I really wanted to be part of telling his story, and I couldn't be prouder of the film we made, so thank you so much again. Hello everyone, Black Grill Awards, thank you so much for this honor. I'm so excited, I, um, I just wanna say thank you. You know, for the opportunity of being able to do The Color Purple, it's been a life-changing moment for me. So I'm so grateful also to my team. Of course, I could not have done this by myself. So thank you to the entire makeup team. You know, also we know that it's a collaborative effort, you know, between makeup, hair, costumes, you know, the DP. I also wanna give a special shout out to Blitz, our director because he's the one that gave me the opportunity. I am so humbled by it. I thank you, and I'm excited to receive this award. I'd like to say thank you, Blackville Awards, for this amazing honor. We do appreciate it, and we are grateful. I'd like to thank our executive producer, Ms. Oprah Winfrey, for calling me for this project. Our producer, Scott Sanders, thank you so much. Blitz Bazawule, our amazing director, for his vision and for his guidance on this amazing project. I'd like to thank Andrea Mona Bowman, my key hairstylist, my right-hand lady, for her contribution on this project and our amazing hairstylist in Atlanta, Georgia, who worked so diligently and so hard to make this happen. Thank you very much. Thank you so much to the Black Reel Awards for recognizing our work on the color purple. Um, I feel incredibly uh, lucky to be part of such a culturally loved story and I'm so thankful to our esteemed leader Blitz for giving me the responsibility to help bring and create the magical world for Seeley's story to come to life. Um, Dan Lawson, of course, for his amazing cinematography, Francine's incredible costumes and our wonderful cast. And I wouldn't have accomplished any of this without my incredible team in Atlanta, in particular my set deco decorator Larry Diaz and my supervising art director Rory Bruin. Again, thank you, thank you very much. Here are the nominees for Outstanding Lead Performance. Fantasia Barino, The Color Purple. John Boyega, They Cloned Tyrone. Coleman Domingo, Rustin. Anjanu Ellis Taylor, Origin. Jamie Foxx, The Burial. Kelvin Harrison Jr., Chevalier. Michael B. Jordan, Creed III. Tayana Taylor, a thousand and one. Sophie Wilde, talk to me. Jeffrey Wright, American fiction. And the bolt goes to Jeffrey Wright for American fiction. This is the fourth bolt win for Jeffrey Wright. He previously won for Cadillac Records, Lackawanna Blues, and Angels in America. Thank you to the Black Real Awards for. Uh, this recognition. Um, I, I'm not uh, doing this work alone. I'm grateful to Cord Jefferson for uh, embracing the madness of writing this script, uh, this script for American fiction with me in mind, uh, and for his um, just beautiful leadership throughout this process. I'm grateful to Tracy Ellis Ross, Sterling K. Brown, Erica Alexander, Myra Lucretia Taylor, Issa Rae, John Ortiz, Adam Brody, Ray Anthony Thomas, and of course, the one and only 
Leslie Uggams. And I am so particularly thankful for Leslie for not only uh, uh, her work uh, playing my mother and elevating what I was able to do along with everyone else, but I'm also uh, thankful to her because having the opportunity to spend time with her reminded me of the work that's been done on my behalf by generations before me in this industry. She represents uh, those generations and those people who worked with utter brilliance and utter grace to make whatever I'm able to do today and all of us in this industry, really, they have made that possible. They have made our freedom possible. Uh, they have fought battles for us so that we do not have to fight them. Things are not perfect, but they have won. Um, they have won so much for us. And so there's not a more beautiful representative of those who bridge that gap uh, from Burt Williams until today than Leslie Uggams. So thank you, Black Real Awards, uh, for, uh, for this honor. Thank you so much to Black Real Awards for this incredible honor. Uh, it was such a pleasure to be a part of this project. Thank you to Blitz for having me. Thank you to everybody at Warner Brothers. Um, thank you to every single musician that helped bring the score to life. Thank you to the cast that had such emotional performances that it made writing music for this project so effortless. Um, and thank you to my entire team. I couldn't do it without you. Thank you all. What's up, Black Real Awards? It's Chi, one half of the legendary duo Nova Wave. Thank you, Tim Gordon, to Sabrina McNeil, all the way down. Thank you, Halle Bailey. We just won original song for Keep It Moving from The Color Purple. What an incredible blessing. This is God's message to you to keep trying, keep praying, keep pushing and keep aiming at your goals. It's literally the worst to the song. <laughs> Check it out when you get a moment. Blessings, blessings, blessings. Thank you, Black Real Awards. We appreciate it. We love you. Thank you, Halle Bailey, again. And remember to keep it moving. One, uh, two, two awards: best, best uh, voice performance and uh, best edit. So that's amazing. Uh, sorry I couldn't be there to accept the award today, but you know, uh, wow, the Black Real Awards. It's a, it's an honor. You know, uh, remember, anyone can wear the mask, but it's how you wear the mask that really makes you a hero. Thank you, Black Real Awards, for our Best Ensemble, Best Ensemble Award. Thank Yay! you so much. Thank We're you. very, very honored for everybody that voted for us. This story means so much to our community, and we are very grateful that you all have thought of us in this way. Yes, we thank you for your love and support. I've been kissing them all night. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.
Here are the nominees for Outstanding Director. Blitz Bazawool, The Color Purple. Ava DuVernay, Origin. Cord Jefferson, American Fiction. Michael B. Jordan, Creed III. A.V. Rockwell, A Thousand and One. And the bolt goes to Cord Jefferson for American Fiction. This is the fourth bolt for Cord Jefferson. He won earlier for Outstanding Screenplay, Emerging Director, and First Screenplay for American Fiction. Thank you so much again, Black Reel Awards, for this for this amazing honor. Um, I went and looked back at some of the directors who have received this award before me. Uh, there's names like Gina Prince by the Wood, Lee Daniels. Uh, Spike Lee, Malcolm Lee, uh, Steve McQueen, just really some of my all-time cinematic heroes. Uh, this means the world to me. Uh, I'm here because of them, and to to be able to add to that legacy is is uh, yeah, it's it's beyond my wildest dreams. So thank you so much. Uh, I really I really can't thank you enough. Thanks so much. Here are the nominees for outstanding film. American fiction. Here you go. Right. Yeah. Wait a minute. Why, why are these books here? I'm not sure. I would imagine that this author, Ellison, is black. That's me, Ellison. Yeah. He is me, and he and I are black. The color purple. <laughs> Origin. Most relationships end. Friendships, romances, they break. Rustin. My friend, Dr. Martin Luther King, will be joining us. How many bodies did it take to surround the White House? How many? Oh. Sorry, I thought that was a setup for a joke. Spider Man. Across the Spider Verse. Wait, 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 hold on. The Mona Lisa. With all the best spider people in it? Okay, so there's this lady, Jess Drew. Oh, she rides a motorcycle. Oh my gosh, I'm learning so much from her. Oh yeah, I, I've learned a lot of I'm stuff too. I've leveled up my whole thing. And the bolt goes to American Fiction. Producers Ben LeClaire, Nikos Karamigios, Cord Jefferson, and Jermaine Johnson. Hey, everybody, this is Cord Jefferson. Thank you so much for this tremendous, tremendous honor. I want to thank Cordell Martin and everybody at the Black Reel Awards for supporting this film and, and for this privilege. I'd like to thank Orion, particularly Alana Mayo and Gabby Cannon, Orion, for supporting the film all along the way. I'd like to thank Jonathan Golfman and Bri Adler at MRC for financing the movie and supporting it all along the way as well. I'd like to thank Ben LeClaire and Nikos Karamigios and everybody at T Street for producing the movie and being on the ground with me every day and supporting me throughout this process. I'd like to thank Jermaine Johnson, my manager and a producer on the film. Uh, he's been with me since day one. I was his first client. He was my only manager. He is my only manager. Um, I love him very much like a brother. And I'd like to thank Jeffrey Wright and the entire cast and crew for supporting me on this journey. I, I had never directed a film before I directed this one. And um, their courage and in, in, in believing in me and believing in my ability to make this movie um, meant the world to me. I would not be here without without their support and without their willingness to to teach me and to um, to be with me on set and support me even when I when I thought that I didn't know what I was doing. So thank you to them. Thank you to all of you. This uh, this means more to me than you know. Thank you.